Yeah, I think um, uh, let's start. Um, so my name is uh, Thuy Dam. Um, one of the member project, uh, the project team leader, uh, Ching Nguyen. He is, uh, he's, he's cannot uh, uh, be here today. So I do uh, uh, update for such live project, uh, our activity in the last uh, period. So, uh, yeah, there's not uh, so many people, but uh, uh, do you know, uh, do you know about, about Searchlight or uh, anyone here use Searchlight? Do you use, uh, no. have some, okay. So, yeah, so I can um, uh, introduce, uh, this is an um, kind of in, uh, indexing service for all the cloud resources for, for example, VM, network, instance, and uh, image. So originally, it is a, a, a category, um, um, like a directory for the clan service for all the image that you have. And then it is extended to index more and more different type of service in OpenStack. Um, so they also had a user interface for, for user to quickly do the search for their resource, for their instances, and quickly uh, do some operation on it, start, stop, and do something with a, a context menu. So it's a more convenient way of browsing around the, uh, the panel. Um, yeah, so um, uh, this project, uh, we try to to make the uh, performance uh, uh, better, the indexing more efficient. Um, so uh, currently, this uh, project has uh, only three contributors. Um, and the current focus of the search line, um, we aim at to um, make it more uh, up to date with the current uh, requirement of the cloud operation and, and from telco, from uh, edge computing, for example. So we are looking at uh, indexing uh, the resort not just in one open stack, uh, but in multiple cloud or in open stack on the edge, and even uh, extend the resource to other kind of cloud technology like uh, AVS, um, Azure, or, or container resource. So, um, yeah. So it's not just only the search and index for a single, uh, for, for, for the tenant of OpenStack. Um, yeah, so uh, given the, we need to update the interest of uh, people on, on this project and functionality, and uh, we intend to carry our surveys on it and gather the requirement and so on. Um, in the uh, last release, uh, Stein, um, we took over uh, the, you know, the project were uh, abandoned for quite a time. Uh, and then when we took over, we start again with the uh, bug fixing and improve uh, upgrading the version for the Elasticsearch, which is the search and index engine behind search line. And then uh, we um, Together, we figure out a, a vision for for this project, which is more focused on uh, multi-cloud. Um, so uh, also many functional tests set up have been done and uh, porting to the new version of Python to align with the current uh, OpenStack projects. Um, yeah, in this uh, style, Given the few number of uh, contributors, we focus mainly on uh, making the project uh, more stable with bug fixing, uh, upgrading the uh, component version, and some uh, minor improvement to the user interface. Um, in the next re release uh, train, we continue to work on the, um, the uh, stability of search light and also look at the interface to allow the source line work with different other cloud platform. So we started with uh, investigating the API of Kubernetes, uh, AVS, and so on. So find a way to uh, connect them with the uh, search index of uh, search line. Um, so, um, yeah, we have some story about this uh, activity. So, um, so 
people are welcome to join to discuss about it. So there are a few uh, uh, story about integrating such like with uh, other cloud platform. Um, and um, we also look at making such like some useful for for other um, orchestration uh, platform. So we know the uh, VNF uh, part in the um, uh, ONF Mano architecture, where OpenStack uh, is a popular uh, virtualization infrastructure manager. So in that case, if the um, a virtual network function or um, or the network, uh, yeah, the um, virtual network service want to make use of OpenStack resource to deploy the virtual network function. So for sure, um, uh, such like uh, when it's provide the uh, updated information about the current resource usage and so on, and even uh, in cross cloud environments and. It's in my opinion, it will be very useful for uh, it making uh, it more useful for uh, for other telco and uh, other cloud provider uh, requirement. So we are looking at the use case and from the story, and uh, hopefully implement some uh, something useful so we can show. Um, Yeah, so, uh, yeah, as I said, we try to make this project more interesting with new use case related to um, um, the, the telco requirement, the multi-cloud uh, idea. So we hope to attract more people to join the project and, uh, yeah, and together we can improve this uh, project. So it's a chance for people to bring in new idea and uh, completely uh, make such like a, you know, a new project. Um, so uh, are you familiar with such light? Uh, have you ever heard of it? <laughs> yeah, so. I, I, I might have heard of it. I, I, I might, might, might have also one of the main reasons why Searchlight is on its own project. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, so uh, yeah, basically what it's done is um, uh, it's have a uh, kind of repository for all the resources that are available in, uh, in OpenStack. And originally, um, in the earlier day, uh, OpenStack uh, as a directory of some uh, land resource is the only use case for it. But now, if we think about such like as a resource cloud resource repository, then it's, it's going to have some, some different role, for example, when you combine it with this uh, new edge cloud functionality with uh, NFV and virtual network function. So it's very important to know if the Veeam, uh, yeah, the resort that is managed under the Veeam layer. So currently it's query over uh, a high level open stack uh, uh, API with REST, but uh, I think it's definitely very useful if we have a, a, a standard or some kind of uh, aggregated uh, API just for doing the resource management. So it's all about the resource, it's not, uh, not just only search and, and, and see it on the user interface. So uh, we also do some uh, uh, like gap research with some other related projects. So uh, we found this uh, Manage IQ project. So Manage IQ uh, also provide user the possibility to um, manage the resource across multiple cloud platforms. So uh, currently, as an OpenStack tenant, you see all, only your resource in OpenStack. But if I have multiple uh, resource everywhere, it, in this hybrid cloud deployment. I have my private cloud resource, I have public cloud resource. Now I want to see them in, in, in one place. So um, bringing this in this direction will give such like, uh, I think, a more interesting uh, use. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> so uh, yeah, we just took over this project uh, for a short time, so there's not much uh, has been done uh, except for forming this new uh, direction for the project. Um, yeah, hopefully we get uh, feedback on, on that. And I think we have 20 minutes, and oh, no, I use 10 minutes, <laughs> sorry. I guess uh, uh, yeah, we can go to question uh, um, session. So do you want to know anything more about Sosli? Have some question, some idea? Um, yeah. I get maybe we can discuss more about this uh, this uh, um, vision for such light in the future. I think that's a really good idea. I think it's uh, it's really natural expansion for search light to go, and at least it gives uh, gives you guys some reasonable way to excuse dedicating resources for the development because as search light is now in my understanding it's it's pretty well like it's done it's doing what it's supposed to be doing and mm. there is like really difficult to justify why you should be working on it because it, it works and it does what it should do yeah so yeah in, in terms of uh, um, providing the search interface and functionality inside openstack is, is already done uh, its job so currently, we still um, keeping update the user experience on that and uh, improve the stability. We, we, we are not dropping this, out of this project, but uh, yeah, together we will uh, extend this uh, elastic search database with additional API to, to give such like more uh, functionality. So uh, I'm, I'm not uh, aware of these uh, um, problems, uh, but uh, yeah, you can uh, tell us by. Uh, I, I don't know why they're doing it, but just like how they are, I, there's no need to maintain it. It, just, it might be a good way to get people as users, how many, if, the, if it, it works without the second school. Yeah. So uh, right now, I think it's, it's failing because it's trying to install Elasticsearch 2. Um, we uh, we know uh, only a few uh, um, provider are using such like, but uh, it's not um, but it's not uh, like the very important uh, feature that they are using. Um, I think the uh, 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 contributor he he are working on uh, making source light in in, uh, in Ansible. So, uh, um, um, but uh, I'm not aware of the, the progress. Okay. Is, yeah. is he working on doing own own deployment, or is he looking because OpenStack Ansible has the search light bits there already? Okay. It just doesn't work at the moment. Okay. So might be a good idea to give him uh, a nudge to have a look of that instead of uh, trying to write his own and rather just fixing what's, what's already existing. Mm. Okay, so I will take this to the team and uh, yeah. yeah, I think that is, uh, that's win definitely. Um, because when people launch up, uh, uh, launch uh, open stack with Ansible, they already see such light and uh, yeah, it's, it's, yeah. it's a very good idea to make them aware of uh, this component. Maybe there's also a reason it's broken, and, and uh, when I ask people using OpenStack, do you know about such like? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but I have a look at it. I know they're fairly open to uh, changes. Mohammed, uh, Mr. Um, 
the PTL uh, for Sushla is not here today. He's mainly uh, have a better overview of everything. So um, I'm uh, doing research and have also um, uh, yeah, not very constant uh, contribution, but it's only on discussion and, and idea. Yeah. On the development side, I'm not very uh, aware. Okay. <laughs> okay, thanks um, for your attention. And um, yeah, this is a very good suggestion. Uh, Thank <laughs> you.